The figures are frankly terrifying. In 24 hours, another 100 nursing homes have reported a coronavirus outbreak. It's devastating evidence. The death toll in Britain's care sector, do we care, we have to ask, is turning out to be the hidden tragedy of the COVID crisis. Elderly people dying in growing numbers, nowhere near their loved ones who can't come and see them, no ventilators to give them some comfort in their last hours. Some of the homes don't even have any oxygen. What are the government doing about it? Well, they're keeping the figures out of the official death toll, even though a study released yesterday across Europe says half of all coronavirus deaths have been in care homes. Are we heading the same way? Who is going to speak up for these forgotten victims? Because the chances of these residents being offered hospital care is vanishingly small. We've all heard anecdotal stories of people being told in homes, if your mum or your dad gets sick, they're not going to hospital. Don't we care about the old, the frail and the vulnerable in society? Surely that is the biggest test of how much we care. It's not good enough. The government is on the rack over a number of things. But in these frightening times, someone needs to reassure people whose parents, aunts and uncles are in care homes that their lives matter. And if you want to hear more from me, tune in to The Daily Show Monday to Friday on Mail Plus at 5pm. See you there.